Okay. Right, so what this guy's doing is going to rob a car. Yeah. And he's looking with his flashlight and he knows what he's doing with his laser dot. Let's see if we've captured some zombies. Yeah, look at these zombies look knockoffish there. You gotta shoot those zombies, man. Yes, I know. Well, you gotta shoot them all. Indeed, I have to shoot those zombies. Yeah, shoot the zombies. Okay. I know I'm basically in the menus right now trying to equip my health as I'm getting attacked by those zombies. I know, right? Yeah. You got a little heartbeat sound. Yeah. Then you're playing through them. Don't worry, you jumped out of it, man. Jumped out like a glitch. Yeah, the game has glitches, though. Yeah. Tell us it's an indie horror game, but it's like, eh. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of so so. Yeah, man, my battery's at 23%, man. Okay. Just let me know if you need to recharge your machine or later on there. No, I gotta go to Camelton, man. When? No, I'm pretty stupid. Okay, just... If you need if you need to go to Camelton, just if you need to go, just let me know, okay? Alright, man, it's up late. Yeah. You gonna do a cameo or what? Yeah, we'll do it. I've been on my freestyle, I'm hitting zombies up, motherfuckers doing it up. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm hitting it up, hitting them, I'm grabbing the motherfuckers doing the thing, I'm doing the sea, motherfuckers doing the throwing the zombies in the sea. I ain't ready for this coronavirus. <laughs> <laughs> coronavirus, yeah, you too. Don't talk about that, guys. That's supposed to be a girl, but it looks like a dude because her hair looks like friggin', uh, you know, clay. Yeah. It's not even real. It's not, it doesn't even look like hair. Scenario yeah. complete. I completed the scenario, apparently. Got an yeah. Xbox achievement. Easy peasy. Let him squeezy. Well, the dope game, man. I gotta back out, so pause this shit, man. Alright, pause it or what? Yeah. Let's get started. Alright, we're started now. Kill J here. Uh, Perfect Welch here. And Jared Rubia is back for this review. And today we're reviewing Outbreak so Epidemic. What are we, so what are we reviewing today? Outbreak Epidemic for the Xbox One. Xbox One. Hmm. This looks like a pretty fun survival horror shooter. Wow. I don't know, it was a horror game. Yeah. You know, I, I think you might be able to get into it, especially since you've had a bit of a blast with the horror genre right now. Jared. Yeah. You know, I had in my middle school and high school years. With friends. Hmm. High school indeed. I don't know, high school. Yeah. My high school was really fun. So, Go ahead. Yeah. So, how do you feel about this game, man? I feel it's not too bad. Well, though. I would have to say, <laughs> wow, it's pretty fascinating. Indeed, it is. Yeah. I say the game looks really good. It's. Re I like the aesthetic, you know, I just like really horror spooky aesthetics. Same here. I'm fighting like a, a reptilian guider. I fought, I fought that, it's like a hybrid creature there. You probably hear my parents talking in the background, I'm sorry about that, they just came back from their drive. It's fine, it's fine, dude. Yeah, I know, I know. I was gonna get uh, probably get later on get Last of Us Part Two. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. 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 Sorry, to get off topic, Sorry. but you think The Last of Us Part Two is a game that you expect it to be, or what? Uh, I'm gonna be honest. Last of Us is a series I do not give a shit about. You know, and when I heard, though, I do sympathize with people who really wanted Last of Us 2 to be a good game, who loved the first game, and then 
basically got shat on with Last of Us 2. Yeah. And and Naughty Dog treating their employees the way they did, you know, because I'm not going to get into it myself. I think all of you, for all those watching, look it up yourself, you know? But the way they treat their employees and the fact that their game sold well does piss me off, you know? So hopefully one day Naughty Dog does get their karma. (laughs) Yeah, I know, I know. It's a shame too what they did with Last of Us 2. Last of Us Part 1 was good. I played the first one. The first one was awesome. Yeah, I see. I like the first one because... Imagine they made Last of Us Part 3. I think they killed... I don't know what to expect. No, no one's back here. It's an indie horror, indie horror game, Outbreak Epidemic. Sure, yeah. yeah. So, what was your, what are your favorite parts of this game, Killer J? The monsters. Yeah, that's always, honestly, always my favorite part of stuff like Resident Evil or Silent Hill. It's always the monsters and what cool, cool stuff they can come up with. The problem with this game is it has screen tearing as you can see in the gameplay, it's like freaking screen tear mania. What kind of monsters is included? So like what kind of monster? Like some zombies, some reptile creatures and uh-huh. stuff like some hybrid zombies, weird ass creatures. Wow, zombies. Yeah. And now for these zombies in this motherfucking game. Remember, like Samuel Jackson with yeah. the snakes on the plane there? See, I know for the snakes yeah. on the plane. You can say, I love that reference. That, that's a good movie. That's yeah, that movie. is a good movie, yeah. I need to watch that. Which movie? Snakes on a Plane. Snakes on Planes. Snakes on a Plane. Oh, say well, Jack. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I need to watch that movie. Sorry about the kid crying in the background. Probably wants something to eat. It's okay. Wow. I'm surprised we actually. Yeah, that's, me. that's okay, Welch. Yeah, it it it's calmed down a little bit now, so that's good. Yeah, this is what it is. It's good me and you and Jared got on this call again. Yeah, yeah you know the kid that lives in my area. You know she 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 complains time by time. But right now she's happy, like enjoying her time. Nice. That's good. That's good. That's good to hear. Nice indeed. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So we're almost done this review. Any final thoughts, guys? Um, I'll say that one day if I get the chance, you know, I'm going to be getting a new laptop sooner or later. So maybe if my laptop can run this, I do kind of want to check this game out. Yeah. You know. And thanks for having me on, by the way. Of course. Oh, you guys me too. Thank you for having me too, dude. No problem, guys. It's awesome. We'll do something like this again in the near future, maybe in Christmas time or when SpongeBob comes, when the SpongeBob review is out. It'll likely be Christmas because you know maybe throughout this month and next, I'm gonna be really busy with okay with my schedule. Oh yeah. It's yeah. Okay. All right. That's it for now. That's it for now. Peace out. Yeah. See you guys.